Hi guys, happy Friday to you. Alright, so I'm going to do my Friday favorites. So I have some fun new makeup items I've discovered this week that I've been wearing like every single day. And an oldie but a goodie and just things that I really love and have really enjoyed. So the first things I want to talk about are from e.l.f. and they are new to the e.l.f. line. These are the e.l.f. smudge pots. They are $2 on the e.l.f. website. They are a cruelty-free dupe to a paint pot. I have been waiting forever for a cruelty-free, smudge-proof, crease-proof, long-lasting paint pot-like dupe. Um, forever and e.l.f. has finally come out with it. So I'm so excited. Um, they look like this. They just come in a little jar. Comes like this in a little jar, it just says e.l.f. Smudge Pot it is in a plastic little case. The packaging, meh, it's okay. But what's inside makes it worth it. So I got the three neutral colors. I got um, Cruising Chic, which is like a taupe. Got a Glow, which is a gold. And then Brownie Points, which is a bronze. So this is what the inside looks like. It just looks like a cream paint pot kind of product. Alright, so let me get some swatches for you guys. And these I've worn on my eyes every day this week as either just a color alone for a wash of color on my lids or for as a base. And they are very long lasting. They don't crease on me, which is awesome because my eyes are hooded. And and once they set, they don't smudge, budge, or move around. Like they are staying put. And I love them. I definitely wish I would have picked up more. Um, I just got the three neutral colors. So I figured that's what I would use them the most for. Because uh, that's what I used paint pots for. I would just use a wash of color and just be good to go for like my natural makeup days. <laughs> so there's a swatch of them. That top color is brownie points. This is got a glow. And this is cruising. Cru and this is cruising chic. Um, some more of a taupey color, a gold, and a bronze. They are so beautiful. Another favorite I have just been obsessed with since I bought it. This is the Too Faced Prime and Poreless. I feel like I wanted to feature this like in my monthly favorites, but maybe I forgot. Or maybe I did feature it and my brain is not working. But anyways, I love this powder. It's just a translucent powder. It comes with a little sifter twist dial so you can twist it over and not get powder everywhere. This is so amazing for setting my foundation and concealer. I love this. I use this every single day to set my under eye concealer. I use the It Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye, which is very moisturizing. Um, so I really need to set it because otherwise I'm going to look really glowy underneath my eyes. This just works so well at setting my under eye concealer. Makes it budge proof, prevents it from creasing, and it doesn't change the color of my concealer. Some translucent powders sometimes make my concealer look a little bit darker. This, however, does not. I also like to use it in my T-zone to set and make myself not so shiny. Ting! I love it. That's a makeup favorite. This is a blush that I've had for a very long time and I've adored for a very long time. The problem with me is I own so many blushes that it's hard to pull back into rotation because I just have so many blushes to pick from. Um, but I pulled this back out. I've been wearing it every day this week. I have it on today. It's just a beautiful coral pink that's not too over the top. It's very wearable. So a peachy pinky coral. It's perfect for everyday wear. It just gives you that warmth and glow from within that makes you look healthy and alive. And I just love this. You can get the balm on Hot Look all the time for like 50% off. Or the balm often has sales there self. Um, so don't full, pay full price. You can find it cheaper. Or I've even, I was walking in Kohl's and I saw the bomb in Kohl's the other day. That was crazy. Um, but so I just love this. Let me give you a swatch. It's just so pretty. There it is there. Alright, so since it's now set, I'm going to rub those elf smudge pots. So you can see there's a little bit of smudging. A little tiny bit, but they're still there and they're going to stay. Um, so what I love about those, they just last on my eyes all day long. Alright, moving into some skincare items and then we're done. Um, so there are two things from Alba Botanicals. Um, this, since it's moving into the warmer months and I'm out in, and I'm outside more in the sun and I need to protect my skin. Um, I've used this for over a year now. This is my favorite sunscreen to date. This is the Alba Botanical Hawaiian Sunscreen. It's the Revitalizing Green Tea SPF 45. 
I love this. It's water resistant and stays on. It really helps protect my skin. And I feel like it's great for everyday use. I slather this on myself and my children and we don't have any skin reactions. And my children have super sensitive skin. So this works for them. And for me, it has a nice kind of slight green tea scent. Um, it doesn't leave you like a white cast on you. It just really sinks into your skin well and leaves you feeling moisturized and protected from the sun. So I really like that. I usually get mine off Phytocost, but you can also get it at Target as well. Alright, last thing. This is a scrub. I usually don't like gritty scrubs, but ever since I started using my Dr. Sponge, that really helps to get off like masks or scrubs and like all those little granule beads. So Dr. Sponge is awesome. It's made me start to like like granule, granule scrubs. Um, so this is Alba Botanical Good and Clean Fruit Acid Detox Fusion Toxin Release Scrub. Um, it's oil free and it's foaming. I love to use this after I go into the gym um, because I feel like it really helps to get out all like the sweat and stuff and grossness that happened, you know, while I'm working out. And it smells really nice. It smells kind of fruity and it has like kind of, and it is like a granule scrub. So if you can see, there's little like particles in there. Um, but it works so well, and it makes my skin really nice and clean. I feel like it really gets off like, and sloughs off like the dead gross layer of my skin and really help prevent breakouts. So I feel like when I'm at the gym more, sweating more, I break out more. Um, so I really like this. So it's just a nice detoxing scrub that's really good for acne prone skin or if you're just like a sweaty person going to the gym like me. It works for that too. Hi, Mom. Hi, babe. I always stay up here. Cheese. Cheese. <laughs> I love you. Yeah. Alright, guys, so that is all my favorites for the week. I hope you guys had a fabulous week and I hope you have a great weekend. I feel like I'm burning up. I have my lion's mane down and the studio lights. Bad combo. Bad combo. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Heart you guys all. Bye, everybody.